Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we're going to be going to Zara and shopping their summer collection. I'm going to be going inside the dressing room and trying things on. I'm going to be linking everything that I try on in the description box. Stay till the end to figure out if I end up getting something. Hopefully you guys like this video and if you do, don't forget to give it a like, subscribe, and let's go shopping. Alright guys, let's dive into what's new at Zara for summer of 2024. First off, Zara is going big on trends this summer as always. Think lots of red pieces, baby blue everything, plenty of two-piece sets, nightest reminiscent fashion items, vest top, denim dresses, barrel jeans, wet leg jeans. There were also so many cute tops and dresses with bows on them. Surprisingly, there was also a lot of animal print. It does make sense because it is making a comeback in fashion. I adored this red dress so much as well as this blue skirt. Like I said, there was a ton of baby blue. Look at how freaking cute this linen pants with flowers all over. And then this flower embroidered vest, so cute. I decided to pick up this mini skirt to try on. Before we go into the dressing room to try things on, I'm gonna leave you guys to see some of my highlights for Zara's summer collection of 2024. <laughs> guys we have made it to the dressing room let's show you what i'm gonna try on i can only show you where you guys are placed right now but here is everything that i'm gonna try on okay so here is everything i have to try on um, we have a couple of dresses i want to check tops and jeans so we're just gonna start i'm gonna show you guys each piece and then the outfits We're gonna start with this animal print top, which is very out of my comfort zone. I never go for animal print or this kind of dresses, but I just wanted to try it on to give you guys um, some options in case you guys like animal print or this style of dress. All right, guys, here is the first one. I feel like the material is kind of cheap feeling. I do think it's very flattering and I'm not much of an animal print girl, especially when it's an all animal print dress. If it were a top or some bottoms, I could go for it, but not a whole dress. I do think it's cute if you love animal print. And again, the style, um, it's very flattering. I normally never go for bodycon dresses, but this one is really cute. Again, if you like animal print. I love a two-piece set when the top is a vest. I picked it up in this fuchsia color, but they also have it in a navy. Online, I could only find the top, but here's what it looks like. I really loved the top vest or vest up i should say and the pants i didn't like so much i feel like they squared me out quite a bit i could see practically no waist definition with this i kept having to pull the pants down because they gave me the worst camel toe but overall the top was a yes the pants were a definite no next we have this white dress which i have been on the hunt for a maxi dress like this with a low waistline and for 109 dollars you would have thought this would fit perfectly but it was so unflattering you guys can see how the fabric crunches up if it's nothing like the model i feel like maybe it was too low of a waistline the model if it pretty loose perhaps i should have sized up but anyway moving on to the next piece we have this really cute yellow cardigan i love the shade of yellow and i paired it with this medium wash high-waisted ankle length jeans these pieces were both a yes especially this cardigan i loved it so much i feel like this is such a lively color for summer it mixed so well with the medium wash of the jeans i feel like the one piece that never fails to disappoint me at zara is their jeans most of my jeans are from zara because they just fit so nice and are so comfy here is a better look at how they fit i love them it was the perfect length perfect high waist and moving on to the next piece which i tried on with the same jeans we have this poplin top in this beautiful baby blue color i had to grab it in a medium because they only had extra small and medium had this been my actual size it would have been perfect but it was a little bit too big it kept falling off because it's a strapless but here's a few more shots of how it fit i really liked it it was very very cute 
I wanted to pick something different and a little bit more formal so I picked up this animal print blouse with a little tie at the waist and I paired it with this mid waist barrel jeans I love the silhouette of this style of jeans I think they are so different let me know what you guys think about this two pieces together I'm not 100% sold on them but this two individually I really like especially this jeans I feel like fits so nicely Next we have this midi denim skirt. I wanted to try it on just to see because I have nothing like it. This wasn't the best stuff to try it on with. I didn't completely hate it but I also didn't love it. I have seen quite a few cute outfits with midi skirts but I feel like this just wasn't the right one. We're gonna end this try on a good note with this maxi dress and this beautiful print which is so summery and reminds me of something that I would see on Farm Rio. The fabric is very thick and nice. I loved everything about this dress. It was so cute. And this was the last piece I tried on. I didn't end up getting anything though. Let me know what you guys thought of this video. Do you guys want to see more dressing room try-ons? Let me know what other stores you want to see this in. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.